And so we've done our injectable RF. I do heat first. The next thing I add is injectable neuromodulation. And so remember this photo. Memorize what it looks like statically and dynamically. I want to uncouple the elevators from the depressors. Elevators of the brow frontalis, depressors, central corrugators, supercilii, procerus, laterally, vertical fibers, orbicularis oculi. I want to knock them off so frontalis does the work. I take 100 units of, and it can be Allergan, it could be Nesavia. They are, Javot in your country, they are basically one to one. This is the only product where I feel my unit dosing is one to one with Allergan International Dollar. So every unit of Botox behaves like one unit of Evolus. When it's Xeomin, and Z my personal approach to Xeomin, I keep Xeomin around because some patients say, hey, oh, I'm allergic to Botox. But Xeomin works great. So I have Xeomin available. I rarely use it. But I need about two units of Xeomin for every unit of Botox to work the way Botox Allergan cell does. I need about four units of Dysport. So it's a four to one. Um, this already is 1.2 cc's, and um, typically you take the sticker off for me, and there's about 0.1 cc of lidocaine already in here. And so I advance and then in inject retrograde. So advance, inject on the way back, advance, inject on the way back, advance, inject on the way back. Slow, retrograde, low pressure injections. Now, as I get to the last third of the brow, that's where I want most of my shape. I'm staying above the hair just above the hair to get a nice light reflex and give a mechanical lift effect. So about 0.3 cc's here in the lateral tail of the brow. And now if I also want to get her temporal hollow, I can go from here, turn, and I can use that same port to rotate and pop right through temporal fascia and be right down into her temporal hollow. Inject a little bit in the middle and massage that in. 11 syringes, but it didn't seem like a lot in any one area, just a lot of areas. To take your face from this to that, from this to that. We uncoupled her brow, we did her RF, we're missing one last thing. Let's go to the um, uh, PowerPoint. The last thing we're gonna do is elevate her face and put a cast on that structure until it heals. 